Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading for the first week of December. Let's start and uh, first let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's start with the current situation for you. You have feelings for them, but you're not you are not doing much right now. You're just healing, recovering, and you know that you should work on yourself more, build that self confidence first, and recover and heal from the breakup. But what happened in the past? What was the main challenge? A very angry situation here may have been an angry discussion problems with communication definitely and uh, lots of disappointment and sadness about what happened it may have been for both of you or especially someone really felt that disappointment i think this is you sagittarius that uh, that situation caused you lots of regrets and uh, stress. But you have been contemplating a lot about it, that you may have missed some good opportunities there. You were spending too much time, energy and focus into thinking about what went wrong, about how bad it may have been, what if uh, something was better. So overthinking, replaying every scenario in the mind. Uh, so even though you were quite sad and disappointed, you still were indecisive about if you should focus again into this past situation or leave it completely. What about uh, what may be affecting you in your subconscious? You want a communication to happen, not just random communication, a communication of love and feelings. Uh, you want them to put the guard down and open up to you. But how do you view the situation with them? It is not easy to forget the past. At least you want a communication to happen. Even if it is quite cold and logical, you want some form of communication with them. What you want to avoid is a painful ending or a repeated ending. You may fear as well that uh, you may fear they may hurt you again. Three of Swords. Yes, that's what you want to avoid. Another hurtful ending. Ten of Swords, Three of Swords. You fear they will break your heart again. And that causes you insecurities about repeating the connection again with them. But what are their energies? They haven't lost the attraction they have for you. Okay, it's very interesting that they know that the connection with you may have had the best potential to build something serious, long-term and stable. They are looking for stability, in fact, but They can't deal with all those dramas. It feels quite heavy. Being in that connection. And they are not sure if the attraction is still that strong enough for both of you. They have attraction. It's not the most uh, strong one. It's not the strongest attraction. But they do have it with a knight of wands there. But they are not sure about it being mutual as a physical attraction. And also they are not sure if the connection can be consistent. I will continue this reading now in the extended with more details about their feelings, how they view you, what are their intentions, what are the mutual energies and so on. If you want to watch the extended, you can find it now in the description box below this video. See you the next reading and bye for now.